Hey, this is Adam Bierman. We're behind the scenes with the amazing new Princeton TV show, Zombie Etiquette. It's, a fr it's Friday the 13th. Let's talk to the macabre cast members. Mr. Zombie, how did this all come about? Hey, guys, how are you? Um, I'm going to get back to that. Right now, what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to pick chairs for the interrogation room. So this particular episode, we're doing zombie victims unit. So I've changed, changed the backgrounds, changed the whole theme of the show to uh, a police show, like a, like a law and order kind of a theme. As in, as we actually have a policeman here, you know. Uh, or. What do you want people, after they watch this show, what do you want them to feel afterwards? I want them to feel a little bit uh, enlightened, a little disoriented. I think it's shake up their uh, view of the world. A little creeped out. Creeped out. Creeped out. Good. Yeah. Let's, let's go over to the... Uh, how, about, how about Sleepy? Sleepy. There's Kurt who plays Duff Dead. You met Heather Scott? Yeah. I'm Heather Scott. I'm the dead one. Didn't your head come off on the other show? Uh, every episode. That's far. Yes. <laughs> Do you feel like bad karma is coming and spir evil spirits might be in your body? Oh, it's, it's coming, yeah. Every, every time we film, yeah. Beautiful. Let's go. Oh, we have some makeup. How did you get involved in this rather dastardly art of zombie makeup? It's that guy's fault. <laughs> Actually, no, I've been doing makeup for a couple of years. Uh, I uh, studied under uh, such people as Jerry Gurgley and Tom Savini and, and whatnot. So that's how I got here. And we have rising young star Leela Davis. Leela, what do you have to say to the kids of America about zombies? Stay away from them. <laughs> and we stay away from you. So can I, um, can I start switching up chairs? I'll bring new ones down. Sorry. Now we have a man in blue. What, are you going to be arresting zombies, enforcing their rights? What's happening? Uh, well, actually, I'm on the show investigating a crime against a zombie. That's good. I, I'm for affirmative action for zombies myself. I don't want hate crimes for zombies. You know, it's not, not cool. Hey, they're already dead. Huh. Anyway, um, now we have uh, Kurt Tazelar, sometimes on that amazing show, Breathing with Beerman. Now he's joined into zombie etiquette. What do, you, what do you make of this? It's fun. Deal with a lot of different people. It's on a local level, and it's a different experience, you know, memorizing some lines and just, you know, that they shoot against a, a green screen and add stuff later. And uh, it's done for its own sake, and it's fun. Uh, but do they try to give like a pop message? Are they trying to discuss any contemporary issues, problems? I have no idea what they're doing script-wise. It's just something I read and then forget. Beautiful.